George Pell, the most senior Catholic cleric to be found guilty of child sexual abuse, has lost an appeal in Australia against his conviction. The 78-year-old was jailed for six years in March for abusing two boys in a cathedral in Melbourne back in the 1990s. Our correspondent Phil Mercer was at uh, the Victoria Court of Appeal where that judgment was handed down. Phil, uh, good to talk to you. It's, it's hard, isn't it, to overestimate how much interest there has been in Australia around this case? Yes, and around the world, given that once upon a time George Pell was one of the most powerful Catholic figures anywhere. He was in the Pope's inner circle. He was the Vatican's treasurer, certainly the most powerful Catholic cleric here in Australia. He's now in disgrace behind bars. We were there when he heard that his appeal had been rejected. He didn't seem to us to be showing any sort of emotion. He was uh, looking pretty uh, grey and gaunt, according to people who've known him for some time. And really, this case came down to the reliability of the witness, one of those choir boys that George Pell abused at St. Patrick's Cathedral here in Melbourne in the late 1990s. And the appeal court said that that uh, complainant was trustworthy, was a truthful witness, he wasn't a liar, he wasn't a fantasist. And as a result, George Pell is back behind bars. He may try to take his case to the High Court, but for now, he's back in prison and facing more years behind bars. Phil, thank you very much for that update. That's Phil Mercer. He's in Australia for us this morning.